Back around here with the city calling on the federal government to help with the asylum seeker crisis, we are getting an up-close look at their struggles to survive as it gets colder and colder on the streets. CBS 2's Jennifer Bisram with the story tonight from the East Village. On a cold, rainy December night, desperation for warmth and shelter could be seen in the East Village. Friday, we're gonna have coats, okay? Some of New York's newest migrants eventually getting coats and hats from staff at Assemblyman Harvey Epstein's office on Avenue B. It's good. Is it happy? It comes after long lines at the former St. Bridget's School on East 7th Street earlier in the day. Many migrants reaching their 30 day stay limit at city shelters, waiting to get reprocessed into a different city facility. <laughs> Community organizations handed out hot meals to many waiting out in the cold. And cell phone videos obtained by CBS 2 show coats being given out, at times being thrown into a second floor window to adult men inside the building. And at one point, food was being handed through the window as well. Folks who were already inside already who still needed a coat but they were already inside getting processed couldn't come out to you know and they were worried because they weren't going to be a coat when they got back outside. New York State Assemblyman Harvey Epstein. Over the last week we've seen an increase of people who are trying to get shelter uh, out in the cold. Half of them didn't even have jackets on. As New York City continues to grapple with the asylum seeker crisis, even slashing 5% from every city agency's budget, city data shows of the more than 140,000 asylum seekers that arrived in the city since last spring, half have become self sufficient, and over 16,000 have filed for work authorization and temporary protected status. They're not sure where they're going to sleep tonight, and we're not sure what the temperature is going to be. But as we approach the winter months and thousands of migrants are still arriving every month, Month. Coats and somewhere warm to sleep will be a challenge for the city's newest New Yorkers. We have a federal problem that needs federal solutions. And Assemblyman Epstein says his office is doing another distribution next Friday. They are accepting donations, including coats, hats, gloves, and scarves. In the East Village, Jennifer Bisram, CBS 2 News.